UFC light heavyweight division collision. Well, we really don't see a lot of guys in MMA with boxing skills like this. Certainly could realize great success as a professional boxer if he so chose. We're glad to have him here on the UFC, though. Powerful punches. He'll wow you with his combinations. You know, some people think the sweet science is a simple art. You watch this guy, it's anything but. Vast differences in ability, in technique. He'll look to put the hands together tonight. This guy is primarily a boxer. And though he has a well-rounded skill set, he prefers to use his excellent boxing technique to get the victory. So back in 2011, he became the youngest champion in UFC history. Johnny Bones has gone on to become the consensus greatest mixed martial artist of all time. Every skill in the book, he has got it. He has dominated. And in terms of the strength of schedule, you can argue no UFC champion has had it tougher than John Bones Jones. John Jones, in my opinion, is the very best at utilizing his reach advantage. If you watch John's fights, he is the very best at keeping fighters where he can hit them, but they can't hit him. And if they get close enough to get a hold of him, he has some incredible wrestling talent to go with that striking. Our tale of the date for this, our main event of the evening. So more than 15 years, the gap in age between these two fighters, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC Light Heavyweight Division. Introducing first, fighting! This man is a boxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA, Dana Lyles. And now we're going to see opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man is a left sea dude fighter, holding a professional record of 23 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, USA! Ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC light heavyweight champion, John Bones Jones! All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go Three down go, go, right ready? now. Well, it is a venue that has hosted some of the biggest fights in combat sports history. And we are back for more. Ready to go with live action underway here at the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. All right, here's the Jackson Wink MMA product, former UFC champion John Jones. Huge, huge reach advantage tonight, as usual. We'll see if he can exploit it here in the early going. John Jones back in the octagon. Fans are going nuts. No surprise to see the comeback. Oh, he lands a huge kick here. Vicious combinations. Big hook. 
Dana White gets hit by that leg kick. Just misses with the straight right. Oh, he landed it. Well, you're playing with fire there. He left the body wide open there, and he has shown an increased vulnerability to that strike, Joe, by leaning in, almost moving into the strike to set up his own offense. We'll see if he lowers that guard, lowers those elbows to prevent further damage. He just whips that punch in. And there's a takedown attempt. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Just missed with the huge kick. Oh, head kick. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, Jones gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Oh, and he goes up top of the kick. And now starting to snap off that jab. Big body, body shot. shot there, too. Oh. Midway through round one. Head kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. Fainting with that kick. Landed that punch flush. There's the swing and there's the miss by UFC President Dana White. Jones gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Oh, sidekick. Well done. Oh, he missed that kick. Oh, nice defense there, Joe, to block that shot. Oh, and he ate a front kick. Oh, he dropped. This could be it right here. into that uppercut, but missed. Well, he walked into his opponent's range there and ate that hook. He was unprotected, unguarded, and he's been susceptible to that hook in previous UFC fights. Gotta figure out a way to move those feet and ultimately circle out and get that head off the center line. That knee might have landed there. Oh, another knee by Dana White. And he lands a knee. He's just holding him here. That knee might have landed there. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Deep breath there. Oh. Reset. Oh. He's got him hurt here. So we crossed the 30 second mark in our opening round. High-level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by UFC President Dana White. Ooh, working well off of that jab. Those punches are very hard. That one hurt. Hit him with the jab. Dana White's lower jaw, very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Let's take a look at it again here. There it is again. And let's see that from another angle. Okay, find your feet, keep your feet underneath you. Hit him a few times. Hey, listen. Brittany Palmer is here as well. All right, second round underway. 
At the end of that round, his opponent was clearly hurt. He's going to... Oh, he got hurt! He's in big trouble. Oh! He's back to his feet, but he's... Oh, hurt. he might be out. Home. He hurt him with that hook. Body kick, look at that. John Jones is punishing the body here. Nice defense on the single leg takedown. You can tell he's worked on that. Trying to take the back here. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. They clinch up. Jones gets up. He is back on the feet here. Boy, Ty clinch now, Joe. A lot of damage can be done here. Knees right here. He's got to get those knees to the body. He lands one. Pretty good knee there by UFC President Dana White. There's that knee again. Both guys appeared to land there. Locks up the plum. And they separate. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of there. Oh, oh big knee! He's hurt! This could be it! Again here, Joe, but he looks hurt. Oh! Look at that, right to the temple. Oh! He's trying to hang on. Big body shot. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Hard straight punch. Oh, very nice. How about that chin? John Jones continuing to attack the body. Now mixing one into the body. That knee might have landed there. Jones gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. So battling for position here on the clinch once again, Joe. Both fighters trying to gain a more advantageous position. Nice knee landed there by Dana White. Good exchange there. Oh, these are high amplitude knees, one after the next. That bruise on his outer thigh is really getting nasty. That knee might have landed there. 90 seconds now to go in the round. Really missed with that right hand. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Jones gets the takedown there. Oh, reversal. Under a minute to go. And he's got his back. And he's back up again. Lands to the body. Yeah, Massive these are what you say about my mother true. punches. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Hard hook. Knee to the body by John. And a good jab. And follows up with another one. Right-left combo by UFC President Dana White. Final seconds here. Oh! Kick to the face! Oh, he might be out. Man, what a round, what a oh, round. Oh, oh, oh. The 
Let's take a look at some of the action here. Here's a huge kick that stuns. Here's a devastating kick that does some serious damage. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. Ariane Celeste with us tonight. Third round underway. That last round was an all-out brawl. If they continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. Looking to avoid that left hand. Shows him the left and then bows it up with the right. Nice one-two punch there by Jones. Able to check that kick as well. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many bodies. Wow! He's definitely oh. rocked. side control, and now he's in full mount. Jones' eye is closing up. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Transitions to full guard. Nice sweep, now he's in half guard. Full mount. Took the back mount. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. He's working from full mount again. He's inside control here. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. He's moved to full guard. Jones gets up, he is back on the feet. Looked like he was in a submissive state on the ground, but he worked hard there to get back to the feet. Just misses there with the left. Under three minutes remain in round three. Right on the button. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. He's in a lot of trouble. Big shots! Whoa! He hurt him! He's stumbling! Just missed with the straight left hand. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. That one hurt. How about that shin? Oh, is that a good knee to the body there by Jones? Well, he absorbs a kick to the head here, left it wide open. He's got to not move into that power shot. Let's see if he can adjust. tonight. Nice straight there by Jones. John looking for the takedown. Front 
kick to the face. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gap. Oh! Oh, he hurt him. Bad. Bad. Oh, he might be out. Ten seconds to go in the round. Finds his range with the jab. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. Take a deep breath. Look at you. You there? All right, good. You're fine right now. You got clipped. You were wobbled, but you're tough. We've trained for this before. Let's see some of the action here. Let's take a look at that again. And let's see if we can get a better look at that from this angle. Ariane Celeste in the building as usual. All right, here's round four, fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. Wow! He's in big trouble. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. That's a big hook. There, the defense is holding up. Dana White's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Oh! Wow! And wow! just like that, the fight is over. And here's the end of the fight. Let's take a look at that from a different camera. Look at this. Crank right on the jaw. Well, what a moment for this fighter here tonight. A massive knockout on the sport's biggest stage. Seminal moment for that fighter tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop to this contest at 41 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner, by knockout, John Jones! Jones! So congratulations are in order to the former UFC light heavyweight champion, John Bones Jones. This is still a guy that many consider to be the greatest mixed martial arts athlete of all time. And this performance, just another feather in the cap of the future UFC Hall of Famer. This was a big spot for John Jones here tonight. He's a guy who always has the spotlight, even when he doesn't have